So with Tavis Noyle here at Hartbury College, uh, Tavis just taking a break from training. How are preparations for sale going this week? Yeah, they're going well. Um, we're preparing well at the beginning of the week and uh, just looking forward to the game ahead on Saturday. You know. Now, talking of games, you obviously were part of the team that played against Scarlets at King's Home last Friday. What was your first experience of playing in front of the cross the, cross the crowd like? Oh yeah, it was excellent. Um, you know, expect that because when I came to watch uh, the Art Queens game last year, it was like on. It was really, um, it was honour to play in front of a good crowd like that, and it was brilliant. Talking to the crowd, uh, things started getting a little bit lively in the second half after you got off the pitch. I hasten to add, um, but uh, the, the crowd really got into it and really started getting behind Gloucester, didn't they? Yeah, it just uh, shows the support they are, uh, that uh, Gloucester have here, and uh, it's just great to be a part of that. And you know, it's, it's great, especially in the second half. There's so much noise as well. Now, as a former Scarlet, how strange was it to be lining up against your former teammates? Yeah, it was good. Uh, it, it's obviously, you know, you make friends uh, during your career, and it was, uh, you know, it was good to play against them as well, and it was good to play for play for this club as well against them, and especially have a good result against them as well. So. That was uh, really good. What about during the game? Were you getting any banter from your former teammates? Didn't say so much. A couple of second rows of flyers were laying out, but other than that, uh, no, they were all right. But uh, it was just the head down and just get a result and just do, do what you could for the team and just don't uh, seep to it. And what about in terms of your own personal performance? Were you happy with the time you spent on the pitch? Yeah, you know, uh, I was happy. They, they explained uh, what was happening throughout the game, the changes they were making and everything. So, uh, you know, the, you know, everybody's quite honest and upfront, yeah, and it's great. That, that's what you want to, as a player, because it's so important and, uh, you know, you stand, so it's good. And obviously Sale come out this weekend at Kings. Um, they're a team who've had quite a strong Welsh influence in the past. Mark Taylor's been there, uh, Andy Powell's been there, and of course, an old foe of yours, I guess, Dwayne Peel, who's currently there. Yeah, um, Dwayne seemed to look after me when I came into the Welsh squad a couple of, a couple of years ago, and he was great, and he's a good, good bloke, but... Uh, you know, obviously when we play against them, you just, uh, you know, you just try to concentrate on your own game and uh, just, just go out there and get a result and make sure it's a good start to the season. Now you've done all the work in pre-season, you've done all the training, you've done all the fitness work, the pre-season training camp, the friendlies. How much are you looking forward to your Aviva Premiership uh, debut, um, assuming you're selected on Saturday? Yeah, you know, if we're selected, I'm looking forward to it. Um, you know, and it's just, just, just work for me. It's just uh, individually, it's just to work hard for the, for the team and make sure uh, just you work together and just, um, just concentrate on your own game.